I wanted to ask you about Caleb Williams. A lot of times when we have this can't miss at quarterback, but he's there for one more year is when we really zero in and we start to analyze and then you look for the flaws. If it was Matt Leinart or Matt Barkley or, uh, you know, you can go down the the uh, list of quarterbacks that maybe stayed one year longer. Well, Caleb Williams had to stay one year longer. But right. what would be the flaws that you would be concerned about with Caleb Williams? You know, I don't see any. Uh, he is a special talent. Zero. Now, Nothing? What I, what I do, well, that fingernail polish was stupid. <laughs> that was stupid. But would you tell him as a coach, get rid of the fingernail polish? 100% I would have told him. Okay. 100% I would have told him. I said, why? What, why what if he going... would have said to you, I make more than you do, coach? <laughs> I would have said, you do, <laughs> and you should be happy about it. And I'd like you to negotiate my next deal. <laughs> but uh, but there was no reason to alienate voters out there who were going to be uh, you know, so pleased with his performances. I mean, he was a special player. Obviously, he got hurt in the Utah uh playoff game or the the uh, championship game by the Pac-12 but uh there there are no flaws he, oh, I mean boy. what he sees his ability to extend plays he's Pat Mahomes he's Bryce Young he's all of that in my mind can't miss can't miss